Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how to transfer Microsoft Authenticator to a new phone. Before we begin, you must know that Microsoft Authenticator only supports Android to Android and iOS to iOS transfer. So if you want iOS to Android or vice versa, you must do that manually. So we'll cover Android first and then move to iOS. First of all, we must enable backup on this device. Before you do that, you must have a Microsoft account like I have one here. To add a Microsoft account, tap on this plus icon, choose the personal option and sign in with your account. After that, you will see your Microsoft account on this page. Now enable the backup in the settings. For that, tap on three bar icon, tap on settings and enable backup. Now we'll move to the other Android phone. First, we will recover the codes on this phone. For that, install the Microsoft Authenticator app and open it. Accept the terms and conditions and you will be sent to this page. Here, you will notice a feature named Restore from Backup. Tap on it and on this page, you must sign in with the same Microsoft account. Let me add my account details. Once you are logged in, you will get this message and the app will start restoring accounts. And you are done. Now let's move to iPhone. The reason iOS and Android can't mix is that on Android, Microsoft saves accounts to its own cloud, while on iOS they use iCloud, so in iPhone, the procedure is same as that on an Android. Just tap on the plus icon to add another Microsoft account, then select personal account and put your email address. After that, we will enable backup by going to settings and then taping on iCloud. If you get this error, it means that iCloud Drive is not enabled. So you will need to enable it from settings by going to your account, then iCloud, and then enable iCloud Drive. After that, we can enable iCloud Backup in the Authenticator app. Once the backup is complete, a message will appear on your screen. Now we'll recover the accounts. For that, pretend this is your new iPhone and install Microsoft Authenticator on this device. Open it up, accept the terms and conditions, and you will see this restore from backup button. You must click here to recover accounts. After that, you will either get this screen with a backed up account or you will be asked to log in. If you are asked to log in, use the same email to log in. Now, the app will start the recovery process. So that's all for this video. If this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Thanks.